There, oh, there was definitely a time when I was down, and I was just like, you know, there's no hope for me, and there's nothing I'm going to be able to do when I'm older. I'm, I'm not going to get married and all this stuff. But um, I just realized, and um, my shirt, <laughs> it says intelligently created. And uh, as I got older and matured more, I realized that I was not, I was not born without arms on an accident, and this was no scientific molecular accident <laughs> that I was born like this. And I, I just realized that this, this, uh, there, there's, a, there's a reason why this happened to me, and not at someone else, but it happened to me. And um, I, I just, I believe that um, that uh, God definitely has a purpose out there big purpose for me and he has a life that he wants for me that I that um I don't I don't know better <laughs> so I, I don't know what's ha what's happening in the future so I just I'm trying my best to follow that and that, that's what keeps me going because I just I know and I firmly trust in that that there's a, there's, there's a reason for this Don't you know? And just being able to kind of go around and uh, play at different places and talk to people, it's it's been I've been I've been able to reach so many people. And um, and I know as a fact that I've been able to reach people who feel really down about themselves and to the point of like of suicide. I've, mm -hmm. I've gotten messages such as such as that. And um, so I I don't really know how many people that I've reached that I've, I've really made a difference in their life. But um, I know that I know that people are inspired and, and changed by what what they see of how I approach life. And uh, how I just get over um, the fact that I, I don't have arms, and uh, I just move past that and do what I can with what I have, and just try to make the most of every day that I'm given. And um, that's that's why I do it. Recently, this this guy on Facebook just uh, contacted me, and he he's uh, an older he's he's older than me. He's not old. He's like 24 or 25. But uh, he That's ancient. Um, <laughs> yeah, but he uh, he doesn't have any arms either. Um, I'm not really sure what his story is on that. He never really mentioned, but he he was telling me that he's just he's very all his life he's been so quiet and kind of um, just in his sorrow and pity, I guess, of, of himself. Mm -hmm. He's never really gone out and tried to make something of himself, I guess you could say. Mm -hmm. And he, he's just, he told me that he just feels really alone. And mm -hmm. he sees, he saw that I had a girlfriend, and we just kind of got to talking about that, and he just told me that he's 25 and he's never had a girlfriend. And he, we were, he was just asking me, how is it that I have no arms, but I'm still surrounding myself with close people and just good you know good people and support and I told him that I just I'm just myself and I and I don't I don't let anything hold me back you know from what I want to do and I know that really spoke to him and um, that kind of made my day and just that was awesome <laughs> I'm 18. I, I just graduated high school, and I've, okay. I've been doing. I, I would say, it's it's starting to pick up a lot more now, as you can imagine. Mm -hmm. But like, um, are you in college? Uh, not at the moment. Okay. Um, 
I mean, is that a plan? Eventually, yes. Okay. It, it, was, it was a plan two months ago <laughs> <laughs> to, to just go straight to college and study music and stuff. But um, with all these opportunities that have come my way, I um, held college off for a okay. little bit because I just these opportunities are once in a lifetime, each and every one of them, and I just want to seize that. And I can go to I, my mindset is I can go to college anytime, but to do to do this and to do stuff like this is um. It's amazing, and it's what I want to do, so.